My name is Brian Brazo, and I'd like to give you a brief introduction to network monitoring using the SNMP exporter for Prometheus. So the SNMP exporter is one of the official Prometheus exporters, so you can get it at github.com forward slash Prometheus forward slash SNMP underscore exporter. Go to releases page, download the releases release, which is 030 currently, and you probably want Linux AMD64. So I already have that downloaded, so we will untar it. So we've got license to notice of the legal stuff, the snmp.yaml, which maps from odoids to useful names because snmp is all numbers that normally looks like dash, which is not particularly useful because how could you tell that that's if in octets unless you have the mibs, but the config file takes care of all of that for us. So we just run the snmp exporter and then that's on port 9116. Now normally with Prometheus exporters, you run them directly beside whatever you were monitoring and you go to slash metrics page and get the answer. Running the SNMP exporter on your home switch or whatnot, not gonna work out. So it works a little differently. One of very few exporters that does, uh, black box being the other common example. And we've got another endpoint called slash SNMP, which takes a target URL parameter, uh, just telling it, hey, what device should I talk to? And uh, this is using the default setup which will pull all the usual interday stats like bandwidth in and out, multicast packets, is it connected, what's the speed of the device. Uh, this is figuring out the names of the various ports from the IF discur, uh, IF description uh, object. If that doesn't work for you, for example, if there are duplicates in there, commonly the empty string, there's also a default underscore IF index module, which will just use the IF index because Prometheus requires a time series be unique. So how would we then go from this URL to actually monitoring something Prometheus? So first we go to the download page for Prometheus on Prometheus.io and download it Prometheus itself. The Linux AMD 64 version is once again probably what you want. And that's already downloaded. So it's here. And we just need a config file. So because of the fact we're passing in the target as a URL parameter, things are done a little differently for the SNMP exporter. So if you go to the bottom of the SNMP exporter page on GitHub and look at the readme, there is an example scrape config. So we'll just go and copy that in and I'll take you through it. So this is Prometheus' config and just to make this demo go a little faster, we will use a scrape interval of one second, which is probably very unwise in production, but I know it's safe here. You can use any scrape interval you want, just make sure your device can actually handle that level of monitoring traffic. So here the name is SNMP, the target is an SNMP device, this all seems normal so far. Metrics path is slash SNMP and we're passing URL parameter of module default. Uh, this is a little more funky though in this section. So this is where it does the jiggery pokery so that this ends up as a URL parameter and Z instance label, but we actually talk to local hosts on port 9116. Uh, this is explained further in relabeling talks, but it just works. The only bit you need to change up is up here. So we'll go and start off Prometheus. So we can then go to Prometheus on port 9090 and we will see it is running here and the instance label is 192.168.12 even though it's actually just talking to the SNMP exporter on localhost. And we can get uh, stats out of that. So let's say out octets, the 64 bit version. We see all the values. Now if we graph them, and do it a bit. These are actually counters. So we can take an eye rate off to see how fast they're going up over time. And I can do all the usual Prometheus stuff like aggregate that up using say the sum. And then we can see the total outward bandwidth that's coming from this switch. Now there are other ways you could look at this data rather than just the expression browser because this is fine ad hoc but not what you want to be using for your dashboards. So there are Grafana dashboards out there. So one example that I've published uh, for use with the default module is the SNMP interface throughput dashboard which is shared on grafana.com. It's number 1124 if you're looking for it. And here it is live. And here you can see all the ports on my home switch and how they are doing. So that was a brief introduction on how to do some SNMP monitoring with Prometheus. All the usual stuff like alerting as well you can also do.